guys, what's up today? I'm here with Yurala here once more. As usual, has all their socials listed on the box. Same color, everything. I got the box, I see the wig. I got a uh, like headband. Oh, and I got, uh, okay, so before I jump into that, I, I got this. So I got this bag with some goodies. I got a head scarf wig cap a pair of lashes and lastly some clips so for today's wig we got some inches this is 26 inches long oh well, this looks like a, a very loose wavy texture i'm going to be sure to put the specific the specifications in the description box so you can see the density all that good stuff the texture everything will be listed there um, this wig is looking so good, I'm not gonna lie. I love the way it feels, it's very soft. Um, the front, it's pre plucked, it's really nicely pre plucked in the front. It's a medium brown lace that we're working with. Um, it's a 13 by 4 lace front, and it has three combs in the front, along with adjustable straps in the back. It's really nice. I love the construction of this. And just look off the wig overall. It came with a center part. Um, it feels good, looks good. Yeah, I like it. Oh, this looks really good. This is really nice. It's been a while since I've, you know, rocked a loose wavy. As you can see, I cut away the excess lace and for today's install, I'm actually in the mood to do glue. So it's nicely pre-plucked in the front. You know, it's pretty decent. If you want to go in and get more graduation, you definitely can do that. But for right now, I'll keep it as it is. It does look nice and it's flat it's not too dense in the hairline so that's really really good as you know when i'm applying my glue i love to do it like in halves at one section at a time so what i do is i cut the lace in like half and then i apply the glue to one side at a time so i clean the area with alcohol and with on my wipes I actually went in before I slid, slid on the wig. So I'm gonna go in and just get started. I'm just gonna do like two really thin layers of blue because it's not like I'm gonna be wearing this for a very long period, but I just love a really nice glue install these days. I personally have grown to love doing my applications now with more with glue than just got to be I, glue in combination with got to be just got to be is like super short term for me these days super super short term like if you're only if you only intend to wear that look for the night then fine and it depends in in what condition if you're going to be in a lot of heat mm -mm, don't do got to be spray because you know what i don't like like if it's hot and then you start sweating and then you probably cool down and that sweat dries it's like it has this white cakey look i don't like that look at all that happens with that so yeah that's not my jam then i take my blow dryer on cool air to be after I, it gets clear i usually just go over it with the got to be so that way when i put the lace on it it kind of grabs it immediately I 
try to repeat the same steps on the next side usually like when i start to cut away the excess lace like in the front and such if there are portions where like didn't get glue like here it's lifting i'll go back in with just a very thin layer so thin that it gets clear after i smear it out almost instantly so i just keep on smearing it out kind of even it out in the area that needs more glue and then once i'm done with that Once I'm done with that, I kind of just push the base down on it and it's good. So that's what I usually do in the case where portions of the lace didn't get any adhesive. So I just keep on cutting away and where more glue is needed, I'll just repeat that same step. See how good that looks the lace is really nice and thin and undetectable so that's a 10 that is a 10 this right here you're really gonna need no form of like baby hairs or swoops or anything I'm showing you that like right off the bat after applying my glue this is how I'm looking it looks really good it looks really really good there's a little bit of cast here not sure if you can pick it up but that's um i lay that in i'll fix that in a few so i'm literally going to stay with my sideburns <laughs> i'm going to do my sideburns and i'm going to do some really light swoops here where i always do my swoops but i made sure to come back and show you guys that you really don't need to if you're not into all of that you know just take your time and apply it and if you're a beginner trust me practice really does make perfect and it can seem a little bit much at first but with the right attitude and focus you'll get it looking so good and laid so I'm going to further get it flat with my wax stick and um, you know at first I thought I would go in and curl it but I love the initial wavy look that it has it's so nice so I'm just gonna get my hot comb and get that really nice and sleek at the top that's it for this installation the hair looks so good it honestly looks so good like i am completely pleased i'm just gonna rock it like that like one side be behind my ear this is pretty this is really nice so i'm gonna rock it with the waves <laughs> It's a really nice loose wave look. Shout out to them. I'm going to be sure to put the direct link to this wig in my description box, guys. So you can go ahead. Feel free to check that out if you're interested in this wig. Also, the specifications of it will be listed. Yeah, this is so nice. <laughs> this is really nice. So shout out to them once more. Um, I'm loving this. It's really soft, by the way, I must say that. Luster is very realistic. Hairline came really nice. And shedding is minimum shedding, right? So bear that in mind. Yes, there is shedding. Um, the, it's very manageable. Even though it's 26 inches long, it's not heavy at all, all right? So please note that. And it is, you know, a nice, natural, w loose, wavy look. So I'll give that to them. It's really nice, so yeah thank you guys so much for keeping up and checking out today's wig look don't forget to go ahead and check out my vlog channel petite suit tv all right and that's it <laughs> so just go and stay tuned go and make up on yourself and i'll see you guys in my next video
Never.